Good morning, Israel. Good morning, believers. In Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, the Heavenly Father, the Only Begotten Son. And the Holy Spirit gives us this power, wisdom, and knowledge to uh, <laughs> talk shit on everyone. <laughs> uh, so, before I get started, I'll say a prayer. F Heavenly Father, oh, thank you for giving your men the ability to tell these people what's what and who's who and to do it without fear or without um, need for rewards from this world because we know the this world is full of foolishness and the foolishness of this world is fading and your truth and your understanding is growing and will endure Amen. Well, here I am. Still here, people. Still here. I don't look, I don't, I try not to look at my views or, um, or my subscribers anymore because it's useless. I'm either shadow banned, um, uh, hated by, everyone or misunderstood or whatever it is and I could give a fuck because I got work to do for my Lord and if you don't understand that step off you'll see it you'll see me when we get there anyhow um, yesterday I was going into the um, the foolishness of the world's wisdom and that's when I'm that's what my channel has basically been about is that um, there's a truth in this Bible that is going to become your reality. It's going to become my reality. It's going to become her reality. It's going to become his reality, their reality, everyone's reality. There's not going to be an eye on this plane that doesn't see how is shy when he comes back. So, um, I'm not going to have to say I told you so because by that time I'm going to be so over even caring about, see, he's getting me ready to, um, to be, to join with him. And there's very few of us that are going to do that. So, oh, well, um, thank you, Lord, for blessing me. And, um, thank you for giving me the chance to try and, um, wake people up, but Hey, they're under a, you people are under a strong delusion and you're under a slumber that, um, <laughs> oh, that you're just not going to wake up from. It just, it's not going to happen. So let me see if I, if they have something under slumber, <laughs> probably I wouldn't doubt it. Um, it's a big, um, sleep, sleep, sleep. Sleepy heads. Um, <laughs> I'll just I'll just stay where I'm at. First, First Corinthians. Um, <laughs> uh, and many sleep. First Corinthians eleven thirty. Uh, I'm right here. First Corinthians eleven thirty, and then I'll go back to what I was saying about wisdom and the foolishness of this world. Um, first Corinthians 1130. Do, 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 do. Ah, ha, ha. Ah. I'll start in 28. This is first Corinthians 1128, but let a man examine himself. And so let him eat of that bread and drink of that cup. 
that bread in that cup is the bread and cup of affliction and the uh, the bread in the cup of wickedness of um, stupor of 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 defiled bogus demonic food that's that's believing in this place that's the bread of this 3d junkyard for he that eateth and drinketh unworthily un, unworthily which means um, in any unworthy manner that means you're not giving your 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 mindset isn't on the heavenly realm. Your mindset is on this earthly realm. And that's why it's unworthy because um, the Bible says if you're not willing to give up mother, father, son, daughter, car, hose, money, you're unworthy of the kingdom. Um, for Verse 29, for he that eateth and drinketh unworthily eateth and drinketh damnation to himself. That's why I was just saying. You're drinking to hell. You're a hell being. You're going down into the grave. You're, you're going to die. You're going to... There's going to be a time when... Um, when there's not going to be any coming back in any judgment. There's not going to be... It's going to be a final... Uh, judgment on the mercy seat where um, you're going to get put where you're put and... Um, you have a very little time left to um, bust yourself open and let the new man come out and put to death that old man, that that dumbass that thinks this world is all there is, that is um, dancing around in this 3D play, uh, junkyard thinking that you're going to um, make a jalopy out of it and go riding off into the sunset. Wrong. Ain't going to happen. Um, damnation to himself, not discerning the Lord's body. So when it says that you're not discerning the Lord's body, you can't see me. You can't see me. You can't see me. You don't see me. Time after time, I refuse. You even listen. Yeah, you know you're not listening, and you can't you can't see me because you're asleep. Your eyes are closed. You're blind. You're deaf, dumb, and blind. So, you know, the Apostle's a great millstone. Um, yeah, whatever. <laughs> All I can say is, yeah, whatever. Um, Nick's, <laughs> I'm not going to, I'm not going to go into that. I don't want to, I don't want to be putting down people that you should be able to see through, but you can't because you can't discern the Lord's body. For this cause, many are weak and sickly among you, and many sleep. I'll read that again, verse 30. For, the, for this cause, what cause is that? The cause of believing in the foolishness of this world, and believing in plantation Christianity, and believing in Buddha, and believing in Vishnu, and believing in the owl, and believing in the government, and believing in anything that's not of... Yahweh, power, and his son, Yahweh Shai, God and cheese and rice for all you English speaking um, witchcraft verbally enhanced people. Um, if you don't know him, you don't know shit. Sure, you can you can take a heart out, Mr. Mr. Surgeon, Mr. Heart Surgeon, and put a new one in. Sure, Mr. Um, scientist, you can figure out a pill to make people not be aggressive. Sure, Mr. Automaker, you can make a car that runs on gas, um, air, um, electricity, coal. Sure, but if you don't know the Lord, all you're doing is goofing around in this 3D junkyard thinking that um, anything that you came up with or anything that you can do was of you. It's not of you, monkey brain. It's of him. He gave you that talent or he made it possible for you to obtain that talent. So there's that. For this cause, many are weak and sickly among you. And that's why I have no I have no um, followers because no one's well enough to even see me. 
You're all you're all laying down in the bed, um, sick and trembling and and unsure of what's going on. You may be or you may be up running around, jogging, um, doing your yoga, riding your bike, surfing, whatever it is that you're doing that you think makes you um, aware of what's going on. Hey, I, I, I'm this. I'm I'm all that. It's you're still sick because you don't know. You can't discern the body of the Lord. So I'll go back. That was just a little sidebar to get you ready for what the real bopping I'm going to give you. So we were in the foolishness of the world's wisdom yesterday. It says, for it is written, I will destroy the wisdom of the wise and I will bring to nothing the understanding of the prudent. That's what I was just saying. Just because you're schooled in this, that, the other, and you're aware of um, that thing, this thing, and, and that other export, import, whatever. You know how to run a fucking ship like the ones I see out here in the ocean. Just because you know how to do that, um, the Lord's going, just just, just revel in that because that's all you got. Um, for after that, in the wisdom of God, the world by wisdom knew not God. But it pleased God by the foolishness of preaching to save them that believe. So he's pleased that I'm telling you this. He loves it. He's all, don't don't let up on these people. Fuck these people. They're not my people. Tell them. Tell them you're, you're done. You're through. Tell them. He loves it. I'll read it again if you don't believe me. 1 Corinthians one twenty seven, or one. 21, 121, for after that in the wisdom of God, the world by wisdom knew not God, the world by wisdom, that's the wisdom of the world, that's the wisdom of this 3G junkyard I'm talking about, knew not God, I'm talking about those professors, those um, designers, those surgeons, the, the same people I was just mentioning. The word by wisdom knew not God. The world by wisdom knew not God. It, but it pleased God by the foolishness of preaching to save them that believe. So it sounds like foolishness for me to be telling you, um, you're better off giving up your job and following me than, um, than continuing what you're doing. But you want, you'll never believe that. Because you're, you're, you're wrapped up in this world. That's why you're um, sick and weak. Because you can't tell the difference between your left hand and, and a stick up your butt. Um, so, we're taught, you know, the foolishness of this world. I, I'm just basically telling you, if you don't know God, you're a fool. Um, so, we're, we're still in Corinthians, 1 Corinthians um, chapter 1. Verse 24, but unto them which are called both Jews and Greeks, Christ the power of God and the wisdom of God, because the foolishness of Yahweh power is wiser than men. So the wisdom I have, you can tell me anything you want about your wisdom in this world. I laugh at you. I laugh at your lack of faith. You're, fi you're a funny guy. You're a funny kid to me. You think you think I'm you think I want what you have? You should be wanting what I have. And the weakness of God is stronger than men. So even even when God's at his sickest and weakest, he's still way more stronger than you um sick unbelieving uh parasites. You know why? Oh man. You know what a parasite is? It's some it's some one that clings to um uh it, it it feeds off something else. So you're feeding off this this world, this beast system. You're feeding off it. You're you're getting what you need from it. You're sucking you're sucking blood out of the beast system, and the the beast loves it. Makes the beast stronger. the The way to end the beast system is stop sucking off his blood and go back to the spiritual. But anyway, I'm going to move on from that because the meat of the message is today is going to be glory in the Lord. It, that's what I'm talking about. 
where is the glory? Where is the reward? Where is the end game where you are exalted and given um, real power, true power, spiritual power, power from the you know, the one who created you, not not from um, some other part of creation. All you're doing it when you're when you're relying on um, creation, you're a parasite. You need you need to rely on the creator. All you're doing is sucking off, um, sucking on Satan's nipple, sucking his cock. Um, glory in the Lord, verse 26. This is just, I'm just continuing in the same vein, 1 Corinthians. This is the Apostle Paul, um, a Benjamite, Hebrew. And um, this is what he says in verse 26 of 1 Corinthians. For you see your calling, brethren, how that... Not many wise men after the flesh, not many mighty, not many noble are called. That's exactly what I was saying. He's not calling he's not calling Bush, he's not calling Obama, he's not calling Navin Gruesome, he's not calling LeBron James, he's not calling Putin. Not many noble are called. This is the point I'm trying to make. I, I, I'm just doing this for your sake. This is, I, I'm already, I'm already, um, sealed. And these fucking GMS boys that say, oh yeah, let's, um, let's, uh, call ourselves the hopeful elect. Yeah. Good luck with all that hope, bro. Either you're, either you're riding in strong or you're deceiving yourself. You're lying to yourself. There's people that lie to other people. And then there's people that are so stuck on their 3D junkyard bullshit that they're lying to themselves. Liars. 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 Lie to yourself. <laughs> so glory in the Lord glory in the Lord that's what I've been trying to say for a year and a half 500 and something videos so what did I say for you see your calling, brethren, how that no many wise men after the flesh, not many mighty, not many noble are called. No, no Obama, no Bush, no Putin, no Biden, no Hillary Clinton, no, no LeBron James, no Magic Johnson. They're not, they're not called. They're getting their, they're sucking off the nipple of, they're sucking Satan. That's why they're full, so full of swimming and cum. Um, not many wise men, not many mighty, not many noble are called. Not very many. For Yahweh power has chosen the foolish things of the world to confound the wise. I have you confounded. I have, I have everyone confounded. You can't even you can't even hear the words that come out of my mouth because you understand not what I speak of because I speak of spiritual things and you're so carnal and so wrapped up in this 3D junkyard you're um, going to perish <laughs> that's the bottom line <laughs> you're you're deaf dumb and blind but God has chosen the foolish things of the world to confound the wise let's see what it says about confound do you know what confound it is Put to shame. I am putting people to shame. You can't listen to me because you're like, oh my God, he's he's knocked me over the head with the truth. I'm ashamed of myself that I'm such a douchebag, parasite. I'm not pulling no strings today. Fuck it. I've had it. If, if, I, if I can't have some fun telling you how lame you are, what good is it? 
Because when this comes, when this, when this is on record in the kingdom, the Lord's going to go, see, that's my boy. See? Sounded like a fool down there. Look, no one listened. But look at you're listening now, aren't you? That's my boy. Yep, yep, yepers. Um, to confound the wise, to put the wise to shame. Think I could sit down with Biden and Putin and go, dudes, all you're doing is bringing in our kingdom. Why don't you, if you, if you wanted to keep your kingdom going, you need to calm it down. You need to act like fucking, like you care. They don't care. They're demons, you dummies. And anyone that believes otherwise is a fool. You're confounded. You're 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 going to be put to shame. And I'm putting you to shame now, so that when you get there, no one's going to be able to say there wasn't people out there trying to tell you. You just you just clicked right past my bro, my son J D Nija. You you couldn't take it. You couldn't take the heat. You just kept going. I'm gonna I'm gonna make this a two-parter because what the hell? Where am I at? Uh, 21. Wow, I've said a mouthful already. Um, he has confounded the wise, and God has chosen the weak things of the world to confound the things which are mighty. So as time goes on, um, my spiritual strength is gonna grow. I'm going to get stronger and stronger and stronger and bolder and bolder and bolder. And I'm going to watch people fall on my left and 10,000 fall on my right. I'm going to walk right through it going, oh, well, should have kept your nose to the grindstone and stopped thinking that that chip was going to help you, that um, that stimulus check was going to help you, that um, that new job was going to help you, that, yeah, no, uh-uh. These fuckers are coming down with wrath right now before your very eyes. They're, if you didn't know, <laughs> if you didn't know, Ukraine is considered the bread basket of the world. The bread basket of the world. That's where most of the wheat and grain comes from that feeds the whole world. Why are they going in there and, and destroying the country? Because they're going to cut off the food supply so they can get you under control. If you're hungry, you'll do anything. People have no idea what is going on. Putin's a devil. Putin, yeah, he's a devil. Anybody that that's trying to destroy God's people is a devil. So I'll go on. They confound the things which are mighty. So these idiots don't know. That they should be listening to me, not me listening to them. And the base things of the world, that base, base is a way that um, uh, the Lord called these people, base, the basest of men. These Edomites and these these beasts, I, I went into this before, you know, and, and, you know, Great Millstone, God bless their soul, they're stuck in there, they're stuck, man. The reason I know they're not prophets it's because they're stuck. They keep saying the same. They're like a bad recording. All they can do is look and go, yep, this is happening. Yep, that's happening. But they're not bringing new meat to the table. And the meat that I'm bringing now is when you think of the beast system, you got to figure where did that, if it's a beast system, why do they call it the beast system? Because these base men, these these men that are, have no spirit in them, these animals, are beasts. I, I went into this. If you were following, if you were actually studying with me, you would understand what I'm saying. But, um, yeah, anyway, <laughs> it's a joke. And um, I'm one of the few that's laughing because I am chosen to laugh. I've been crying long enough. It's time for me to start laughing. People are going to hate me for sure. I'm counting on that. I can't wait to be hated. 
I'm already being hated. People are hating on me for all kinds of reasons that don't make any sense. Just because I have it and they don't. The base things of the world and the base things of the world, verse 28, 1 Corinthians. This is Bible teaching. This is the real deal. This isn't fucking goofball um, GMS or or one of these Negro camps that thinks just because they're, they claim Israel that they got it. They don't got it. They're bullshit. They're, a lot of them are just playing, trying to make money, trying to convince you of this, that. Um, they're badasses. They're of the God. Fuck that. I don't need to convince anyone. I'm sitting here telling you, don't believe me. Go ahead. Don't believe me. I don't give a fuck. It's up to you to grab this, not me to, to um, spoon feed it and change your diaper. Wah. Wah. Don't talk mean to me, J.D. Nyja. Fuck you. I'm trying to help you, dummies. The base things of the world. So the base, the basest of men. If I could, if I had that memorized, I would, I would pull it up for you. But the basest of men are these beasts, and the things which are despised has God chosen. Yea, and the things which are not to bring to not things that are. So, actually, in this, in this case, he's talking about the way the world sees me. Um, the world sees me as base. They, they. What are you talking about, dude? You're just some surfer. You're just some drug-addled surfer, gardener. What have you done in your life? Blah, blah, blah. And the base, he chooses the base things and the despised. I'm going to be hated, which God has chosen, yea, and the things which are not, to bring to not things that are. So the things that are not, this place is not, this place is not spiritual. This place is not right. This place is not of the Heavenly Father. This world is ruled by Satan. Hello. 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 <laughs> it's satanic here. This is the 3D junkyard. Hello. So what, what's happening is we're going to bring things um, which are not, which is, this is not the kingdom to bring to not things that are uh, time to get rid of this place. We get, we got to get rid of this place. That's what he's saying. God has chosen yea the things which are not to bring to, to not things that are <sighs> that no flesh should glory in his presence. Do you think <laughs> uh, I'll be back. I'll come back to this one. I gotta really, I gotta really get ready to, I gotta get my boppers in both hands for this one. Cause this is, this is the meat. I'll be right back. <laughs>